the GX03 float plate assembly. It consists of two component parts, the disc and the two spring arms for attachment. This is going to provide support to the GX01 deck plank in the float installs, the PK11, PK12, and PK13 that will go over uh, waterproofing in a simple uniform slope, creating a floating floor scenario, supporting, of course, the deck plank and the surface finish of a thin gauge porcelain tile, natural stone, or glued or dry lay paver material. The two parts, again, are the float plate with the top and bottom. The disc itself has a smooth bottom here. This is the bottom side going onto the waterproofing and the rib side. The rib side contains two channels to receive the spring arm attachments. Those are going to connect via the small spline on the back side of the spring arm. That's going to intersect with that channel, push to snap in place and to engage the spring arms. Two of those per assembly. And now that assembly of the GX03 full plate is complete and ready for insertion. This can also receive a micro disc or micro height adjustment. This is a 32nd of an inch thick. Simply remove the adhesive liner sheet on the disc, place it in contact with the disc itself, low light pressure, and now you have contact. So this is going to then engage with the deck plank. Now the deck plank itself uh, has the top and the bottom side. This is gonna slide in from the bottom. It can go into any one of the openings or cells that best suits the install condition or parameters or alignment. Simply insert one side into the opening cell, press the other's top other spring, give a little light pressure just so it is able to slide in, and then press to lock. That is going to then engage the top of the deck plank and rest into the little notches in the deck plank itself, keeping it in place. So all of these are gonna be placed prior to placement onto the waterproofing. Insert three of these minimum, one, two, three per 30 inch side of the deck plank dimension itself. And these are gonna be placed 24, 16 or 12 inches on center, depending on the load conditions uh, and depending on uh, how much tolerable spring in the assembly is required. A minimum of nine or 24 inch on center per deck plank. So with all of them in place, they're ready to go. Simply turn it over, drop it into the position where it goes on the waterproofing. And again, it does have the ability to slide so you can slide it into position for its best and proper fit. That's the GX03 float plate component intersect.